Hello everybody, Forever Yolu here with Bobaful Revolution. Um, this is what I was taking over for um, Super Mario Bros. Um, it's taking over because I I suck at Super Mario Bros. Honestly. So, you guys are seeing me play Super Suit Plus Super Mario Bros. Um, Bobaful. Right now it is 1:37 a.m. So. Yeah. I have no school today. One second. I'll play the classic version first. Um, I've played this game before. I played it before the arcade version, I guess, which you would say. See what you do is you you hit the person with like a bubble, and they'll get engulfed by a bubble. Your en the enemy with a bubble, like that. Me popping with your horn on top of your head. That's pretty much all you do. I prefer this version more than the newer versions because the newer versions aren't as great, I guess. It's like I, I like the classic one. A little bubble. Bubble bubble, yay! I think this is Bub, Bob, something like that. I forgot his name. I haven't played this since I was in like, I don't know, second grade, so I was like when I first played this game. And no, I'm not that old, it's just that like I had like an arcade vending machine in my big hair thing. And this game was like one of the only games I would ever play in the arcade thing. Ever. Ah crap. Okay. So yeah. You get hit by the you get touched by enemies, you'll die. Obviously it's like a rule. Hey, look, I don't have to pay for it, at least, it's something good, if I lose. Triple pop, or quadruple, yeah. Um, even when you blow bubbles, you can still get points out of them if you pop them. You get at least, I think, ten points out of popping them. Yeah, I just killed myself trying to pop them. Here, one second, I'll show you. Get points are just popping regular bubbles. Okay, well, and this is what happens when you die. It tells you where you went, how far you went, and then game over. Luckily, we're playing the DS version though, so we can go back to our round and we're on and we do the round. we get a hang of this game really, really uh, for a while, I guess, after a while. This game would be a lot more easier if I wasn't tired, though. How the- that- that one feature thing just gets far past me. Uh, the rest are dead anyway. Cannonball! Oh, and when there's one left, the other one will become more faster, and it's like a anger point, I guess, in a way. You get angry. Because you probably like you killed them. They'll start becoming more faster, and I guess a little stronger. Jump up here. No, you want to. Hey, look, hey, there's food items. These food items give you points, obviously. You've seen the points so far. This is literally an old game, so... Crap. That thing is like, I don't know, it kills things instantly, kind of thing. Ah! It killed me again. Hate dying. Okay, we're on Ryan's round five.
give me a second. Okay, I'm back. You should seem a little faster, I guess. It's not more controllable. I died again! Is it- wait, really, hold on. They're all dead, except for one. Gotta catch up for him too, before he goes up. Ooh, ice cream. I think I just- I think I got one- I got an extra point. Did I get one? The extra life? Yep. I got, a, I got one up. Alright. That helped. I can beat the high score. Watch out for the rocks, though. They seem to get in your way. Those white ones are new enemies. They'll try to roll, roll, roll rocks at you. I don't, I don't know all the enemies' names in this game. Yet. But I'll figure out later on do some research on this game. I actually would love to do research on this game. A lot. best to bunch them up because then you get actually a lot of points. Banana, oranges, that's sushi. Sushi! Nah, man! There's sushi right there. There's sushi. I like sushi. Not really, but it's still edible. Ooh, beer. I will probably have the high score because I rock this game. See what happens when you get them all in a group. That's extreme points. Like, I think it's like a really a really high amount of points you can get like within just. A, a big bunch of them, just attacking a big whole bunch of them. Okay. Now let's get the rest. I have no clue what these things do, no, so don't ask me. I forgot it. I do forget things about the game a lot. But it does something. Something I do now. You can also bounce on the bubbles too. You gotta, you gotta have the right timing though to do it. There's gems, strawberries. This thing pretty much eats anything. Anything that, that'll grow in the wild. Lol. He's a hippie. Balls turn red, that means they're about to bust. When they're green, there's usually just bubbles. Blue, they're usually, like, I guess they have special powers if you get enough of them. They have a like, special ability to them. This is the part I hate the most. I have to wait for my death. Ah, oh, come on. Kill me already. I guess I gotta wait for a bubble. One of those blue ones. 
Wait for it, and this is the. I show you the power, the awesomeness. And when they say hurry up, it means they're getting ready to go really fast. That noise, that means there's a white dog, or it's like a white dog thing, I guess, creature, or a white dinosaur thing, it's like it attacks you. This one's not as hard as the rest. I like killed myself. Oh well. Hey, look, I spilled tin. Alright, the end. That's why this one's not that hard, it's because you don't have to even go in there to attack them. It's dangerous, honestly, to even go in there. I still spell tin. See, I'm a good speller. Oh, I spit fire now. I spit fire. I'm a dragon. Rawr. Not a bubble dragon, but a fire dragon. Oh, my bubbles are back. Oh well. So trying to figure out what my letters are gonna spell. I spell Extin, diggity. Don't worry guys, I have a plan. Wait for it. And they're all dead except for one. Okay, that's it. Alright. Falling. Next place. Those are the two people we're supposed to save. You're supposed to, you're supposed to, this, the, pretty much the story of the line of this game is you're supposed to save these friends of yours. They're really close or something. I think they're either your family or something in, in, in this one. But I didn't think it's their friends in the newer version. It's an umbrella. I'm, oh yeah, the umbrella means I can skip a couple levels. Nice. Forgot about that. One of the awesome reasons I love this game, you can skip levels if, if, you, if you have a certain amount. Okay, the new bubbles. Those are the thunder bubbles. You can like, like let like lightning bubbles or whatever. Okay, well I have the high score, obviously. Ah, uh, D, J. Yeah. There I am. All right. We're gonna leave you guys off for at level 19, for around 19, and I guess that's where we leave off. I will see you guys next time on Bubble Waffle.